okay. for your students as well. I mean, it's part of what we're going to be talking about today, right? You've got to be determined. You don't give up easily. When you try, you try and try. So I said, you know, there are people on Facebook who need to, you know, I want them to benefit from this. You know, I want them to. <clears throat> so Jennifer, you were talking about, you know, what inspired you to, you know, go into the financial institution. Let us quickly touch quickly on FinTribe, right? Um, yeah. you know, what motivated you to start FinTribe? Okay, so FinTribe is a community of women, women only. Basically, uh -huh. what we do, the core of our activity is savings. So uh -huh. we have this our uh, platform where we do monthly savings contribution because I realized that most times it's not as if people are bad with money or people don't want to save. We just need that extra push. Mm. Mm. And everybody, almost everybody has one saving app on their phone or the other. But maybe we no. use it January, February, New Year resolution, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. The Murad dies and then we go back to the first setting. But mm -hmm. when you have a community, when you have someone pushing you, mm. in fact, hey, <laughs> God, the way I rush these people on that community, so because we save every month, Mm -hmm. Once it's time for savings, if you are, you wake up to Jennifer's message, you will sleep to Jennifer's message, reminder, asking you, have you saved this month? You know, that extra ginger is what actually keeps, last year we were close to a thousand women, and this year we are taking it up a notch. So if you are here, and you feel that this year you're going to save like never before, you're going to invest like never before, come and join our community. It's free membership, you're not paying anything to join. The only requirement is that. Be ready to consistently save money every month. And the money you save is not coming to me, no. We are partnering with a custodian. So any money that comes in is going with them. They're the one in charge of it. And the interesting part is we don't just save and leave the money I do. No, we look for credible investment. Mm -hmm. We invest this thing so that at the end of the year, it's a one-year calendar, it's a 12-month calendar something. By mm -hmm. December, everybody gets back their saving with interest from our investment. So that's basically what we do. And then now and then we have other activity like this year we are planning a business trip. Sometimes we also do um, this uh, book food sharing, we buy together, this is save money for us and a lot of other things. We are going to be having some money talk occasionally and all of that. So if you're a woman and you want to get your money right, join us. That's it on FinTribe. Okay. Amazing. And when did you start FinTribe? When did you start this vision? When did you start? So for the service part, and that's the thing with this thing. Sometimes you start something without knowing where it's going. I think the first time we did this was in 2020. If you remember earlier, I said 2020 was the year my eyes opened that Jennifer, yeah. you are messing up with your money. So because I was trying to find ways mm -hmm. to make um things better for myself, because mm -hmm. I know that I really want to save, but I need help to do it. And mm -hmm. I called a few of my friends. We were like 13 then. I call okay. them, oh yeah, babe, so far now. I want to, can we start a group saving something? Of course, they were in. We started. Okay. And okay. it was so, it went so well. The next year, 2021, we did it again. 2021, we are now like, I announced it openly now. About 300 and something women came on board. And last year, we were close to 1,000. And this year, I'm like 5,000 women must save money properly this year. So, um, it's not that actually in 2020, just that, you know, you something you just start, let's just do it. And then it's growing and it's going, um, going beyond your expectation. It's now mm -hmm. that we are now trying to put more structures around it, be more intentional with what we are doing and all of that. Amazing. Thank you so much for sharing that. It's very, very important, uh, you know, for women to see, especially in this age and time where everybody is at this job so I, I must ask you how has the journey been you know every time we start you know something that's one question people don't ask because then you arrive at the success headquarter like they call it but then i always love for folks to look back you know how has it been so far there are businesses with your challenges so i want you to share the good parts i want to share the challenging parts <laughs> of course the best part is usually the impact Esther, if you see my inbox December last year, there's yeah. some messages I read. I'm like, I feel like crying, like because yeah. you really have this kind of impact in people's life. You know, money is at the center of most things we do, but yeah. unfortunately, we like to pretend as if yeah. uh, me, I like money too much, but it's like a taboo for a man can say it and get away. Men can yeah. talk about money, brag out, they, you know. But if a woman says it, so be as if she's materialistic. Yes, I'm materialistic. 
I like money. So um, knowing that people are actually doing amazing things, so we sent a message that they were able to buy a property they have been eyeing, they have not been able to do that, but through the savings, they did it, they start that business. They, it's, th those messages are it for me. But for the challenges, hey, number one, this is, uh, at the moment, it's, it's a free membership, but no association runs without money. Mm. And now we decided that we want to make things more structured. This year we are putting a lot of things in place. Mm -hmm. Recently we launched a platform where people can just sign in, do their thing without interacting with any human. Because as you are trying to expand capacity, you also need to be, make sure you are ready for it. Okay. Esther, they want to kill me with Billy, no? Hey, just simple platform. If you see the abuse these tech guys are giving me, I'm like, what is going on here? Mm -hmm. And then you want to register with uh, relevant government authorities. They want... Mm -hmm. Oh my God! Why did you ask me this question? If I start crying here because the frustration of doing some things, you you want to do things the right way, but sometimes I think the system is working against you. We have some regula uh, regulators. You want to register with and all of that, and the demands is just <laughs> I, I don't know. But regardless, regardless, I know, like you said in the beginning, it can be a little bit crazy but thank god everything is working out fine mm -hmm. and i have um thank god for people really thank god for people because most times you need to do something a who do i call and then you have someone by the side okay call this person do it this way do it that way mm -hmm. i've been blessed with amazing people guiding me on this journey so so far so good really so far so good mm -hmm. yes, i, I want to take you on that text thing and that's because you know i've invited um two women who are fintech forces. That's always, yeah, I mean, I'm talking Shola Kinkbelu, Shola Kbea Kinkbelu, and um, Kemi Ogunkoya, right? And Kemi talked about, you know, the challenges of our own leadership ex hub and Shola mm -hmm. also told me about her own harvest. So I sh sincerely understand, you know, where you're coming from and, you know, yeah, and where you're going to. So now to the big question why a lot of people joined. And before we even get to the big question, really, Esther, you know, the, the thing you do with women is really beautiful. Women of Fubis, you know, you try to highlight women doing big things. And I don't know, I hope you get it a lot, but thank you. Because we need to show these women out there. When you Sometimes when you read these people, you're like, oh my God, this person is doing this, therefore I can. I hope you understand the impact that platform has on us. Thank you so, thank so you. much. We've been doing thank amazing you. work with you, women of Fubis. Thank you. Thank you, Jennifer. So, yes, um, I mean, at the end of the day, we've got to put in the work. I, yeah, I get that a lot, but I try yeah. not, like Oprah would say, um, make sure the compliment stays here. Right? <laughs> so that you can use here all the time, right? So this would fit this. When it's fitting right. this, you know, you, are, you have a balance. Oh, yes, I'm doing something worthy, but in the same vein, I want to keep getting better. So thank you so much. Yeah. So yes, so the big question is how can we save and invest wisely this year? Hey, now, if we are on this section, break it down for us. You okay, know, great. some of the some tips in savings. So, say for example, someone that hands, let's say for example, minimum wage in Lagos, and this person is saying, ah, I'm already challenged with bills, right? What would you tell this? Because I want to break it down in the layman language. I don't want folks to think we're only talking millions, millions here. Right? <laughs> so I want to use that as an example. So how do we advise this? And then, of course, for someone who lives abroad, who is earning minimum wage, how would you advise that kind of person to save? What are some of the questions you often ask people, right, to meet them where they are at? So the thing is that, like we hear all the time, if, let's say, you are earning minimum wage today, and you are not, you can't save something from it. Mm -hmm. When that income doubles, triples, whatever, trust me, you mm -hmm. may still not be able to save something because mm -hmm. it's a lifestyle. In fact, we hear stories of celebrities, rich people going broke. Mm. You'll be like, how isn't this to blow millions of, even billions of naira? So let, let me let me tell a quick story. Where I used to work before. So the staff have this, um, we, we, they had this um, contribution thing, the one they do uh, once they pay salary. So there we have staff, uh, we have the full-time staff, the normal staff, and then we have the, uh, what do we call them? The, uh, sorry, I can't remember the name, but the, the, okay. the manual, these ones do odd job, maybe the loaders, the cleaners, 
and these people they earn minimum wage. I don't think any of them earns more than. In fact, none of them earns more than thirty thousand. I was an accountant there, prepared the salary. None mm -hmm. of them earn more than thirty thousand. Mm -hmm. But it would interest you to know that the main staff, okay, can mm -hmm. yeah, we call them casual staff? Mm -hmm. The main staff that their contribution stuff. There is this guy that is a casual staff that is doing that contribution with them. So this guy is earning 30,000, 20 something thousand. Mm -hmm. And he is doing the same contribution with people earning 200 and something, 100 and something. Mm. Of course, maybe he has other side, um, side income or anything. But it's, it's always an inspiration because, guy, mm -hmm. this is your salary. And yet, yeah. you're still saving the same amount with these other people. So mm. I believe that he has system in place that helps him to do that. So uh, maybe before I, I will tell you the practical ways, the things that help me to save personally, there was mm -hmm. this post I made um, last year, how I saved money. Let me just, some hacks or tips or something, things you can mm -hmm. do that help you actual um, save money before we come down to the system. So okay. last year, the best, the best thing, of course, you try to cut costs. Now I'm going to share some things that I did that helped me to cut costs. The best mm -hmm. thing I bought last year was an inverter. That mm -hmm. inverter was a lifesaver. Because mm -hmm. every week, I buy fuel, my fuel gallon is like 5,000 to fill it. Then, no, not now that fuel has gone, they will even see to buy. So, then I buy, I buy fuel like three times a week. That's like 15,000 mm -hmm. for generator alone. Mm. But since I got that inverter, mm. I can buy fuel. Water. In fact, this year I have not bought fuel this year. The fuel that is the generator, that may be the one I bought last year. I, so, I saved a lot of money on fuel because of that inverter. It was a one time, I think I bought it around 250,000. My apartment is pretty small. So, I bought it like 250,000. For a bigger mm -hmm. apartment, it might be more expensive. But trust mm -hmm. me, it is worth the cost. So, mm -hmm. if you have means you can save money in your place, let's start from there. Let's reduce our expenses before we even. Maybe something else I did. I moved last year, I moved to a place closer to my workplace. Of course, the rent is higher, but it saves me a lot. I was spending an average of ten thousand naira last year daily, going back um back to and fro work, and mm -hmm. it was it's a lot. But since I moved here, I don't spend that much on traffic uh, on transport anymore. Let's not um talk about the Lagos um this thing. So these are some of the things you can do, even cooking. But there is this thing I notice when I'm alone, I actually save more by eating out. I don't know, this might be an unpopular opinion, but when I'm alone, I save more eating out. But my sister came here, she's now here, and now we cook more often, and it saves us some cost. So personal finance is personal. What works for me may not work for you. So find a system that, which, look at these things, which one will save you more money? Is it cook? Of course, if it's a family, definitely cooking, with, uh, cooking your food yourself will save you more. So those are some of the things i do to save more but then when, we, when it now comes down to the system itself of course give yourself a target like there is this push that comes knowing that this is the amount i want to save by the end of the year when you have that, that specified target it pushes you to find a way to accomplish it so this year how much do you want to save and then people um Esther, can you see the comment section well, I am Instagram. I can see. Don't worry. Okay, please. The comments are dropping. Type on the comment section. How much do you want to save this year? I want to see. I want to see the figure. Mm. Just, just type it there. Let me see. Please tell me. It's very important to me. know. How much are you planning to save this year? Tell me. Tell me. Um, I, I'm waiting for you. If you don't type anything, I will be looking at ourselves here because I really need us to make these things happen. Yeah, so, I mean, I've, I've typed it. So let's, let's, good. Yeah. Do you know that that figure you type? Mm -hmm. Or I don't believe that's what you'll be saving this year. If you type 200,000, my sister, you will save 200,000 this year. That's the assignment I'm giving you. And you are going to take it in Jesus' name. Okay. So, because the thing is that, the, the, in fact, be bold, be bold with your target. So, this yeah. will happen. When you set this high target for yourself, your mind opens up to yeah. find ways to accomplish it. Worst yeah. case scenario, you may not hit it, but you'll be very close. Now, you mm. want to save 100K. I'm telling you to make it 200K. You are going to do everything possible to make sure it happens. At the end mm -hmm. of the year, two things, you might save 200K or something close. If you save 150K, it's so higher than the initial 100K you are going to save. Either mm. way, congratulations. So now we have a target we want to uh, achieve. How mm -hmm. can you make this thing happen? 
it's always easy when we automate um some of these things automate your savings i tell you people a lot if you have money in the bank where is your salary account or where your business money goes in give them a standing instruction every date on this day they beat so 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 amount to this account trust me mm -hmm. because i know you have good intention you want uh, to save money but my uh, sister if you don't adulthood billion we we help you spend that money so give yourself that for that push let it be going out automatically do you mm -hmm. get mm -hmm. call your bank on monday ask them about standing instruction or if you are saving with maybe a fintech thankfully mm -hmm. most of the fintechs around now you can even do it on their system automate mm -hmm. it put your card so that on this particular date automatically it's going to debit you or if you are here and you are in our contribution group tell them yeah what we do now everybody in the contribution group has a unique bank account so mm -hmm. if you are with us give that account number to your bank also mm -hmm. we used to start from 25th from 25th to 5th you can tell them on 30th maybe if, you are, if your salary is not this you can give them a date so this one is going to help you so mm -hmm. that's it have a specific amount you want to save automate mm -hmm. your savings mm -hmm. another thing okay i should have even started with this one I, I i should have started with this thing pay yourself first i know you hear it all the time Mm. Yeah, let's go but that would have been the first thing i mentioned but thank mm. god i remembered it mm. when you hear pay yourself first you'll be like ah what are these people saying it is a very simple thing where your income comes in how much are you removing for yourself my sister mm. wait so when i say pay yourself for yourself i don't mean flexing money your enjoyment money mm. no mm. that one will come later this is money set aside Mm. for your financial goals it can be the one you now want to be like okay this is the one you are saving towards your target or the mm. one you want to use for investment you are going to talk about this night is loaded though mm. we are still going to talk about investment which is my own which is where we are heading to all this one we are talking is just like a means to an end do you get so step put so when you just save your, pay yourself first you've given yourself a target of what you want to um save each, at the end of the year of course mm -hmm. you want to break it down what can I afford to save monthly? So you are earning fifty thousand. You can decide out of this fifty thousand, I'm saving ten k. So mm -hmm. that's ten k. As your salary, that could be the amount you are telling them to automate to put on uh, automatic debit. Now you know that you are left with the balance out of your fifty k. Just tell yourself that it's forty k you have because that ten k is non-negotiable. It's not even part of your income. That one is going out immediately. So you have to find a way to live within that forty k. And that mm -hmm. is where budgeting comes in. Maybe we'll touch briefly on budgeting. Mm -hmm. So that is number. I, I, I just quickly needed to bring that out so that you know that it is that is how you structure your own money. Because okay. what the problem we have is that most times we don't know where our money is going. We don't tell our money where to go. And if you don't do that, like I said before, balance will help you direct it. Okay. And then I, I let's uh, remember accountability. I think when I was talking about fin trial, that is the, mm -hmm. like one of the key advantage uh, you get from being there have mm -hmm. an accountability partner mm -hmm. it can just be a friend maybe someone just make sure it's also someone doing the same thing as you mm -hmm. call up a friend or join the community so because mm -hmm. then you know that i am your accountability partner and i know they see face i don't smile when i'm doing my accountability partner work mm -hmm. so call up someone babe how far let's do this every month both of you get on that automatic debiting at the end once the alert goes share screenshot with each other how far they don't debit you they wish you know it keeps you like now you are accountable to someone else it's easy for us to cheat ourselves or oh, don't worry we'll do it later but when you have someone checking in on how far have you done this so mm -hmm. please try that that is actually the essence of the community i started when i said i called up some friends back mm -hmm. then that mm -hmm. was the whole idea so please you can even get someone from the comment section in fact who is ready to pick an account accountability partner this night i need you to type in the comment section if you are ready just like i Look at each other after that. If I go to your comments and go and uh, DM someone for the no, comments. People are, I can see a lot of big, big money from your question. I'm seeing 200,500k. So people are in high spirits. 1.5 million. I mean, Ow! It's going to happen. It's going to. In fact, if you, if, if you need inspiration, go to my page. Sometimes I share messages from people sent me at the end of the year. Look at these messages. Tell yourself. There is one that is a copper. Copper's earned thirty thousand, mm. and when she said the amount she was able to save, I was it was so it, it, it was so exciting. Mm -hmm. You see that big money you are dropping, my sister. It will happen. It will definitely mm. happen. But mm. of course, I don't know. We might not be talking more on uh, income streams, but mm -hmm. the key is that 
big money. The income you are last year shouldn't mm -hmm. be the same income you are this year. Of course, mm -hmm. if you're a salary person, mm -hmm. thankfully you might get a promotion, you might not, but find task yourself. Mm -hmm. You are going to create a new income stream for yourself. Mm -hmm. Please, that is one of the easiest way to mm -hmm. get this kind of starting a business. I know you are very busy. In fact, I wrote a post a few days ago how to make time for side ones for busy women. Go mm -hmm. and read it. There are ways you can. Last year, I like I have like how many income streams? Seven. I mean, I just start to know. Mm -hmm. As an investment banker, investment banking is one of the busiest professions you know. But we still find a way to make these things happen. If you are that busy, you can get someone, pay someone, you know, to run. There are some people that have pages on business pages on IG. They're not the ones that handle it themselves. Someone yeah. is there. So just mm -hmm. put some structures in place. Uh -huh. You can knowledge sell is something you should consider, please. Uh -huh. Knowledge, it can be an ebook, it can I don't know. There are so many things you can do. Do you get okay? So that is by the way. I have left the one I'm talking to another one. <laughs> Okay, so I was talking about accountability partner. Yes, please find some this night, this after this call, look for a friend you will call or for the comment section. Find someone, find someone, embrace that person. How far can we do this? Or better still, join our contribution community where we have over thousands of women doing the same thing you are doing. We are going to keep each other accountable. And then before we wrap it up on the savings part, there is something I call a no spend day. Mm -hmm. A no spend day is basically um how do I put it? That day you're not spent, you're not buying anything, you're not paying the only thing you're allowed to pay for is transport. Mm -hmm. Eat the food you have in your house. If you're that data finished that day, leave them to the next day. So this it helps you to know that there are some there are some things you spend money on that are actually things you can do without. Mm -hmm. But because it's like a routine, because it's like a habit, you are going to the office, you have to buy tea, you have to buy coffee. Like, I don't know, you must buy, I don't know, but give yourself a no spend day. It's time just one day in a week. And tell yourself every Tuesday, I am not spending money on anything. If you have keys, of course, keys can have their demands. On Monday, provide all the things you know you will need for them. Provide it on Monday. On that Tuesday, you can't spend on anything unless transport that is taking you to your place of work and coming back. Try this, trust me. Some people do up to two days, three days in a week. It will, let, it will help you to see the loopholes that, ah, this thing I used to buy, I didn't die. I didn't buy it today and I didn't die. And the more you um, expand it, the, the more you can go maybe two days, the more money you save for the day. Do you get that? Okay, so and, um, that's basically it on the savings. Aha! Uh -huh. And please, many of us have some of these Netflix subscription, visual subscription, gym subscription, and we don't even use some of them. If you know all those subscriptions you are not using, unsubscribe. Eh? When you are ready, you can go back. I know New Year resolution, all of us has gone to the gym to go and register. By next week now, we'll go back to default setting. Don't worry, when you get tired, go and there's the gym I went to. Not only you, me, I went to I went on Saturday. I said I want to join gym. Give me a card number, let me pay. They say no, that I have to impute my card. And I know they are plans so that every month they'll be debiting me whether I come or not. And Thankfully, and unfortunately or unfortunately, the location was a bit far for me. I want to go. So I pay you for this thing now. This location, traffic will kill me here. I left. But had it been I went on and subscribed, any day I feel like I'm tired, I will go and tell them to move my because I, I saw a post one time on Facebook, a gym was debiting someone automatically, and she was not going. And she was angry, telling them to remove her from whatever. So if you have any subscription, you mm -hmm. are not using. I don't know why leave it there. Unsubscribe, you will not die. And all these, some of you, your favorite vendors, we are on their email list. We are number one on their email list. Today, they will tell us, in fact, my skincare has finished me. It was last year, my principal should leave. I have to unsubscribe. I'm on a skincare journey. People have finished my life here. So I'm on a skincare journey. But and they, those people, their marketing is so brilliant. Every day they will send you this one. Ah, have you tried this one? Okay, use this discount code. Have you? Ah, ah. If you go to my bedroom, there are so many lines of skincare things I'm not using. I have to yeah. subscribe. People should come. Let me finish the one I have. So if you know uh, email subscriptions like that, that makes you to buy things you don't need, please go and unsubscribe for them. Your destinies are not tied together. Remove yourself first. Get yourself. Remember, we have a target we are chasing. We have one million we are saving this year. So mm. eliminate all those distractors. And then I believe that these are the things that will help you have more money to save. 
But remember, saving is a means to an end. We don't stop at savings. We have where we are going to, which is investment, the favorite part, mm -hmm. my favorite part. Because this year, we are all becoming investors. Investor Jennifer, investor Esther, investor, what is your name? All of us are becoming investors this year. These are things, you know, the truth is that when we talk about investments, People get skeptical. If you're on Facebook, you've all had a lot of dramas. They serve us breakfast countless times on top of investment. But the, the truth is that these are not even investments. These things are not investments. Investment is, is not a Ponzi scheme. People come to you, then you are doing this, are doing that. All of us, you, me, they don't chop my money too. Not the only, if I get sent, they don't chop my money too. So we are all in this together. But now we are going to understand better. And I believe that. When we know better, we can do better. So please know that even that money you are saving, you are not stopping there. It's a means to an end. And shortly, we are going to talk about investment, but maybe we can do some housekeeping. Are we following? Can you hear me clearly? Yeah. Are you learning something? People. Are you ginger? Are you what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> people, people are, I mean, the, the people in the comment section. Yeah, so let's get right into the investment. I'm, you know, excited to, to know more about that. Okay, so it's one thing. Service is beautiful, service is nice. But you agree with me that if you save 100k today, tomorrow you still 100k. Mm. Next year you still 100k. In fact, next year you not only be 100k because by then your bank has removed their service charge. They've mm. removed that. They've removed this and that one. Your 100k will be like 90 something. Do you get? Mm -hmm. And the plan is to be able to get to the stage where our money works for us. Mm. You work hard for your money. Why should your money be chilling when you do the hard work yourself alone? No, you should be working. Your money should be working. And when we hear things like uh, make money while we sleep, our uh, mind goes maybe all this affiliate marketing and um, Ponzi scheme. No, no. The phrase make money while you sleep is actually talking to investment, credible investment. And I'm going to list this some options for us briefly. So let's talk about um, fintechs. Fintech. Thankfully, there are so many fintechs out there today that can help you grow your money. Because when you say anything that will grow your money from point one to point two is investment. So if it is a saving platform that is paying you interest, it's investment. So there are so many of them out there. Just find uh, one you trust. Find a few. I don't know if I can call names, but there are a couple of them you can. Many of us, many of us have these apps on our phone, just that we don't explore them. Some of them actually have investment um, options. Check them mm -hmm. out. Is uh, yeah. why I said this one is it's, it's, it's something all of us can do. Bring out your phone, do these things, and it's there. That money you would have left in the bank, just move it from here to here. Uh, mm. You have to be patient with this. Thing. I think I should be mentioning investment is a gradual journey, it's mm. not a money doubler, it's a gradual journey. So you don't expect to put 10,000 and they're saying, Ah, how much will you pay me? 20,000 from where. What business are they doing to be paying you that kind of um, returns? So it's, it can be small. So there is something that maybe when I talk to some people about investing, they'll be like, what's the interest? You tell them 8%, 10%. That, it's small. And then six months later, maybe it was an investment option that is like six months duration. Six months later, they are still there. Their money is still in the bank. In fact, the money has gone down definitely because as an adult, um, debit alert will be going out. Six months later, they have not done anything with the money. And you've made the little, so-called little interest you did on your own and you've moved on. So if extra 20,000 is something, but to them, they be like, ah, it's small. They will keep waiting for big one. Here we finish. So understand that it is a gradual journey. Over time, compounding is going to accumulate. So start look, at, look out for all these fintech platforms. The ones you trust, start with their options. Let's quickly go to the government has um, many opportunities for us to invest our money. Yes, the interest might not be as exciting or as high as the ones that have dealt with us in the past, but it's something you can invest and go to sleep. That is one thing that any investment that wants you to do, ah, you'll be having double mind. God, I beg go. You should be like a countdown to maturity. Why the, your peace of mind is not what it's what all that thing now. So um, we have the one we call treasury bills. So treasury bill is like this. It's you borrowing money to the government. Yeah, you are lending money to the government. Government borrows money from us. 
so it can be it's usually let like, you can you decide the tenor you want to do it can be like three months six months one year but it's not it's, it's not more than one year each tenor the longer the tenor the more interest you make most times minimum is like hundred thousand for treasury bills so what you have to do if you're interested in that call up any investment bank personally i use that free invest that one of the top um, investment banks in there are so many of them we have fbm quest we have coronation there are so many of them i use afri invest so reach out to them tell them what, what you have they will share rates with you normally it has different rates different tenors and different rates look at the one that fits you more put in your money and go away at the end of the tenor come back collect back your money and the interest on top in fact you can even get the interest ahead of time let me tell you something so my clients i work a lot with wealthy people the kind of wealth we are aspiring to do you mm -hmm. get and there's always something to learn from the rich there's this friend of mine he bought a car last year this car beginning of the year he told me uh, mm -hmm. he did an investment it was a good sum the interest on that investment he said he was going to use it and buy a car for his birthday which is towards the end of the year he just left the money there and gave away at the end of the turn of the money matures, he took back, took back his money, kept his capital back, and used the interest and buy a car. Now, what do you get here now? It's like he bought this car with free money. Because he still has his capital with him. It's just interest on the capital that he used to buy the car. It's, it's, a, it's a whole lot of money he invested to be able to do that. But it is free money. I tell you and I, we be by the side. Ah, see the car this guy bought. We're not going to use our last card to buy our own. Not knowing that this person is actually doing this thing. It's free money. So that is how we fund my rent. My rent, I pay my rent with interest from investment. That's the way I plan it. My rent is due in April. So what I did was last year, I did some investment that I know that we mature. And um, between March and when the investment is due, so that I would have left the money in my account. I can just be like, okay, my rent is. I can say, okay, this is two million rent. Let me just leave it. When the summer, we sit and pay. Or I can decide to invest the money, use the interest, and pay the rent, or just add money to the interest. This way, you don't feel it. So these are the ways the rich people fund a, a lot of their things, even yeah. school fees. If it's school fees, that's the way this year many of them were withdrawing money in January because they've already invested this money way back, knowing that I have a like I have a, an expenses and expenditure to make in January. That is the way I need you to think. That is the way I need your head to be work when it comes to your money. If you want to buy something, can that thing wait? Can you do an investment that will make you an interest you can use or part of you to fund partly or wholly of that thing you want to buy? Okay, that's by the way. So that is it about treasury bills. You lend the money to the government. Another one that is like treasury bill is commercial paper. But in this case, now you are lending money to businesses. Yeah, you are lending money to business. All these big big businesses you see, Dangote, MTN, Stan Big, all of them borrow money from you and I. Yes. So they raise funds from the public. They come to us, they take this money. It's also mostly 180 days or 270 days, mostly. So uh, the interest on commercial paper is way higher than treasury bill. Because now you're looking at the risk level. You know, every investment has an element of risk. You know that. The only thing is that find the one with low risk. Treasury bill, we call it low risk. You know we call it low. We don't say zero risk. We call it low risk because it's the government. Government will not run away with your money now. If Buhari leaves tomorrow, we put put the be or you know, so the government is always there, they will pay you back your money. Now, commercial paper, the level of the, the risk level has to do with the company. Is this a company that will go down tomorrow or not? Mm. I think in the history of commercial paper in Nigeria, no company has ever defaulted, they will always pay back. So that, that's the risk. I, I want you to have an uh, idea as I'm telling you, I'm telling you the risk involved so you have full information on what you are getting into. Mm -hmm. So commercial paper pays higher interest because of course it can be as um, trustworthy as the government. Mm -hmm. or it, it, can ha it has a higher risk level than the government. Mm -hmm. the one, there is one that we concluded last week. The company is DLM. The interest was like 16 percent, 16 point something percent. My sister, no, no bank will pay you that money in your savings account. No, they will not pay you that. So it's just the same way. If you want to um 
get this one take advantage of this call up any investment bank send them an email both on their social media ask them they will guide you accordingly mm -hmm. <clears throat> of course this one okay though the commercial paper is mm, the minimum is usually like 5m if you okay. can afford 5m you have the 100k own if you really have the 5k own yes there is still bonds so we have bond that is what we call fgn service bond that is federal government service bond these are the five thousand minimum mm -hmm. of five thousand you can do it how bond works is like this but that one is on a longer term it's like two years or three years mm -hmm. you decide mm -hmm. the one you want so mm -hmm. when you invest in bond they will pay you interest four times in a year they used to split the interest so mm -hmm. that every four every uh three, three months you'll be getting paid at the end of the tenor you take back your money so mm -hmm. service bond come up every month usually first week of the month so if you are interested in this as well reach out to any investment bank they will guide you account five thousand naira. now you don't have any excuse again so moving on i think i'm going to just move on straight to okay this should be the last one there are yeah. so many options available for you mm -hmm. but i can't end this investment talk without talking of my favorite mm -hmm. stocks stocks mm. and etf like every woman should be a shareholder everybody should be a, i shared a post uh was it three days ago apple apple of iphone mm -hmm. that the, the, the annual general meeting is coming up so they sent of course they'll send their shareholders um email you have to come and vote they have to vote for are they returning their directors the um have the money they're paying directors we the shareholders are the ones to vote for these things mm -hmm. and i'm like jennifer you are in Lagos, so and the number one company in the whole world is asking you to come and make a decision. It's asking you to come and vote. Why? Because I'm a shareholder. It's exciting to know. Do you get? Mm -hmm. Like you get to take part in this action. If all the rich, the richest men in the world, check all of them, check the Forbes list. Most of them, their money comes from the stock market. Mm -hmm. It's either they are investors like Warren Buffett. Or is their company valuation the share the shares of their company their mm. company valuation that's where the, their wealth comes from so mm -hmm. if this is a proving system that's mm -hmm. working for these people why mm -hmm. can't you and i mm. do you get mm -hmm. and so when you hear uh, becoming a shareholder it's not a big deal it's just as if oh, i take my money let mm -hmm. me buy your share in mm -hmm. exchange i become a shareholder that's mm -hmm. all Mm. and you are not giving them money for nothing you are getting something in return what mm. are these things you are getting in return two things they can be paying you dividends mm. and your money will be growing there so mm. let me use for example um december 2021 it, it, it it's still strange to me when i say when i want to say so i can't say last year because last year is not 2020 hey um, so december 2021 mtn did primary offer this mta you and i use we spend our our all our money on mta and buying, mm -hmm. data, buying airtime mm -hmm. do you know you can also make money for that same mta that's the way we think about these things i spend money on netflix subscription i spend money in iphone products i spend can i also make money from these companies mm. yes you can by investing in their shares mm. so december uh 2021 mta did primary offer then they were selling shares for 169 naira 169. Mm -hmm. of course if if you are on my social media or if you are connected on social media i i i carried it on my head come and buy mtn i think they were paying me i was i i did live sections i thought because i knew it's it, that is a great decision so we bought 169 then last year mtn paid dividend two times they they paid one towards the beginning and then they paid another one towards the end of the year two good times one of my clients when he got his mtn share he's a big man they, so his own dividend was win i think they paid them six naira eight naira the first time and mm. then they paid six naira the second or five point something the second time he yeah. had so many units he have he had um, thousands of units so when mm. he now multiply it by the number of the, the amount of dividend it was a whole lot so that was his first time receiving dividend so he sent me the screenshot because it said mtn something he was like ah jennifer um what he, he doesn't understand what the money is from i'm like size your dividend yeah he was so excited like really because this was a whole lot of money and this is money he made that doing anything making money without lifting a finger just by take, just it's an investment you do once and then relax so that is one and then that mtn we bought 169 then now it's like 200 and something everything is selling like 200 and something 
So you can decide to sell it off now. And they're selling at a profit. And it's not magic. It is standard. Um, it's, it's a structure that's been working all along. So mm -hmm. please, whatever you do, consider investing in stocks and ETF. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. I have courses, simplified courses, classes that can guide you. Just go mm -hmm. to the link of my bio. I don't know where you're tuning in from. So mm -hmm. these are the things. And you can start with any amount. So I've told you, MTN sold 169. Don't you have 169? That means if you had 1,000, you get like how many units? Save. You can start with any amount you want. If you are, if you want to buy, I uh, that foreign uh, foreign shares, of course. That there, there are so many. There are some apps you can use to do that here in Nigeria. From here, you download. Is this things are very easy to use. It's just having that money. Are you aware of these things before now? Like I said before, now we know better. I expect us to do better, and okay. I think this should be it. When it comes to the option of the investment, you can make. Uh, uh maybe we can see if someone has question or so well, yeah somebody has a question i wanted you to finish uh she says please how does mutual fund works is that a good investment to start with as a beginner yeah so mutual fund is like a pool of funds it's like this mm -hmm. maybe you want to invest they will collect money from different investors mm -hmm. all of us how much do you have bring how much do you have bring? they'll bring everything together the fund managers we now go and invest it in something. So that thing they now invest it in any income from it, they will have share it or they pay they pay interest. So one thing you should know is that it's not it goes up and down. It's not steady. One time it's you might invest ten thousand. You can come up one day and see nine thousand something. That that can still go to eleven thousand something like so it goes up and down. But it is it's a nice option for beginners because now we are not you're not start out, what should I invest in? How do I do that? No, just pay in the money and let the experts do their thing. And if you want to do that, I think there are different apps you can do that on. Um, Esther, can I even show some of these apps um, for them? No. Anyway, let them, just let them follow you because we're going to give those apps free half. You know how it goes. So, <laughs> so there are different apps you can use to do this. Or you can also reach out to investment banks. Mm -hmm. They will guide you on mutual for what is a mm -hmm. nice option. My apologies, everyone. You know, um, you know, the hubs, you guys know how it goes. So yeah. I'm, giving, I'm, giving, I'm giving that free ad, but Jennifer is my own friend, uh, you know, in the sisterhood. So yes, I can always have you guys. If you want to know more, here is a deal. Follow Jennifer. If you're on Instagram right now, follow her. Listen, if you can spend, I did something a few days ago. Let me tell you, I spent one hour on your page. So when I just got out my journal, for every tip, I was writing it down. I have my vision board on one side. So I was canceling. I was adding, okay, this is the financial goal for now. This is what I want to do. So I'm telling you, you follow Jennifer, there is a lot of information. Everything she's mentioned here, you would use that seat as one of our Twitter templates. <laughs> you can see it as a video. It has everything on there. So you can follow her for that. However, Jennifer, I just want to ask you because I know you know the, you've shared so much information today in short time, and this is what I love. When a guest comes in and there's value immediately, so I am learning. I heard about Treasury bill from a friend four years ago, and now Ooh. I am a little bit angry at myself that I did not take it seriously because through that Treasury bill, he started a business. That business Ooh. now is making so much money because I said. Ah, Treasury bill with government. <laughs> but now that you've broken it down, because he's a layman, right? He's not into your field. So perhaps he was not able to break it down for me to say, listen, government is not going to fold up. Now that is the key into selling. Yeah. Because off my head, I'm like, ah, if what is going to carry my money? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> right? So I, I think I have more clarity on that, you know, and I think, you know, I'd encourage anyone who wants to go into Treasury bill. Now that we have an understanding, like she said, you know, the risk is zero. You get your money back, one way or the other. And you're still going to get interest. So my question for you, Jennifer, there are a lot of women who follow you. You know, we've talked so much about money, empowerment. I also want us to touch on the women who don't have this money to save. Right? What would you say to that kind of woman watching us right now? Who is saying, ah, either treasury you or mutual fund, or any of these things you've mentioned, I don't even qualify for it because I don't have the fund, not because I am lazy, but yeah. because life is not just favoring me. So for that kind of person watching us right now, what would you say to them? 
Okay, so I I think I mentioned it earlier that in as much as you want to save and invest, you first of all have to make that money. You mm -hmm. need the money to save and invest. Mm -hmm. And then I like I like to I, I like I, I like people to always have an open mind that mm -hmm. there are opportunities everywhere. Mm -hmm. Of course, you know, when you say this, they'll be like, I don't have capital to start. Maybe mm -hmm. I can, I should quickly run through some examples of mm -hmm. things you can do without capital. So yes, if you're yes. with us here now, maybe you don't have a job or your job is not paying you enough. My sister, mm -hmm. this year you are creating a new income source for yourself. How? Let me use an example. Mm -hmm. I think I mm -hmm. made a post sometime last week on i, I use delivery service mm -hmm. for example so i i was like imagine you are in a city my like lagos on the chap or all these big cities where you know e-commerce is in fact e-commerce is thriving ev in every state right now but there is still this mm -hmm. headache every online business person has mm -hmm. deliveries all of them have delivery um this thing they are using but mm -hmm. The headache from this God have mercy. If, 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 if dispatchers are giving business people shake it back to back. Now, do you know you can come in and solve that problem for them? Mm. I mentioned it that I said hey, the best dispatchers I have worked with were these two guys. Mm -hmm. They don't have bikes, they don't have delivery van. They enter bus, they enter bike to do their delivery. They come to me, they pick the items, they find it. Uh, nearest boss or whatever to the way where they're going and mm -hmm. they're making their money so these are things you can in fact i was on a live section was it two days ago with um someone veronica's daughter so we the a discussion we, we i mentioned this and she was like wait so that a woman came to her about three days earlier mm -hmm. that's please so she wants to be doing her delivery this one and that one mm -hmm. she asked the woman okay where is your but the woman said don't worry that she doesn't have a bike that she, but she would do this, you know, she was able to buy her trust. Mm -hmm. And in the last two days, she told me how much she has paid this woman. She said that they were on session. The woman did three deliveries, one, one, five. And this one, five, that's like four, five. And she didn't spend up to one, five in all the three deliveries. How, how much is boss? 200. It's, thank God for Google Maps, Seth. You can use Google Maps and locate your, go here. And sometimes when the deliveries are, that, that's some big businesses on Instagram, that uh, mm -hmm. the kind of deliveries they do. Even if, if you will build a business around you, you will recruit people to be doing it for you. And yes, you will say, ah, they have people delivering for they have people delivering for them, but everybody is looking for a better mm -hmm. option because it is giving them if the if a dispatcher is not telling you that last month held his bike or there is a his bike broke down. And these are excuses you can't have because you don't use a bike. So it's even a selling point for you. So if you can do this thing, stand up today, reach out to in your area. You must that are like even inside the market. All these people in the market, they do on they do online sales. They need, talk to them. If you don't know anyone offline, come online, reach out to vendors in your um, social network, talk mm -hmm. to them, buy their clothes. That day I made that post. People were even getting jobs on the comment section mm -hmm. because every business person has this delivery problem. Someone mm -hmm. was like, okay, I stay in New York, please, oh, please. And all my was like, please, are you in New York? Let's talk. Like, okay. if, do you get? That mm -hmm. is one. I also shared a story. See, when I came to Lagos, um, that was three years ago, then about. Mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm an Igbo girl. I like money. So whenever I am, I'm always thinking of how do I make this money. And mm -hmm. I know that in Lagos, people always see Lagos as like the happening place or uh, where they can get things cheaper but yeah. if you are in the east you don't have that access and I was coming from the east I know how we yeah, want to get this uh, in Lagos but, so what I, I made a post how far are you are you outside Lagos do you want to buy things from Lagos send me yes I don't mm -hmm. do market runs in Lagos what is there they send me their list I entered the market I was I'll be doing video call okay do you like this you mm -hmm. know and they pay you at the end of the day. If they pay you ahead. Mm. So that is an option. You can do drop shipping. What is drop shipping? If many of the successful businesses mm -hmm. you see online today, they started from drop shipping. That is zero capital. I said, mm -hmm. hey, let me tell you how I started selling hair. I think it was on mm -hmm. Facebook. One woman, she runs a saloon. So she was like, I love talking about business, of course. I love talking about money. So people mm -hmm. can come and discuss their business challenge with me. I will find a solution to it. Her whole solution mm -hmm. was that she couldn't buy good hairs. She's mm -hmm. always buying fake hair, you know, all this problem. I took it upon myself. I started researching for 
reliable sources she can buy hair from. Uh. I gave her the list. And, and then I was like, wait, so Jennifer, I, I wait to, you know where you have to buy this hair now. Before you know, I said it's like I'm selling hair. I will take pictures yeah. and sample. I don't have one night. I was a broke ass that I had better have money to buy human hair. But thank God for the online um e-commerce structure today. You pay ahead. So when you get it, advertise these things. Somebody, if you get a customer, they will send you um uh, of it's paid before delivery, of course. Mm -hmm. They send you money. You take their money, they move your own profit, buy the thing mm -hmm. and send to them. And the mm -hmm. interest, let me even tell you now, because mm -hmm. you say I'm not in Lagos, let me tell you. When I started selling hair, I was I was in no worry. But we know that you buy hair from Lagos. How I was mm -hmm. not seeing the hair I was selling. What did I do? I went online and looked for vendors. Vendors I know people trust. Vendors I know that are selling good. I reach out to them. How far? Please, when I, can I use your pictures? Let me sell market for you. Of course, everybody mm -hmm. wants to sell market. I created a page immediately. Hey, God. You know, also for this life, fool. I created a page. So when I get these pictures, I post, I talk about it, I advertise it. Before you know mm -hmm. it, people will start calling you a hair seller. People start knowing that you sell hair. And when mm -hmm. you are able to build trust, that's mm -hmm. how business started though. So once I have an order, I will call the hair seller. Please, I want to buy this hair. Send it to this so-so person in my name. They will package mm -hmm. it, write your name, send it to your customer. You carry mm -hmm. your money, pay them and keep your profit. Mm -hmm. These are options for you. So you that is not doing... And, Oh God, that is a whole lot. That is a, in fact, I have a class coming up. This is one of the things we want to discuss. Out of 15 different side hustles, 15 different businesses you can start. So mm. if I do me a favor, go online on Google this time. Start when, is, when is your class? When is the class coming? Maybe we Every can. Day. Oh yeah, by this time. Maybe, maybe we can. It's um, on 28th. So okay, we're going to be talking about side hustle options, investment savings, you know. Oh, Not that I these are learning this too. like That day to be hot. So. Yeah. Yeah, I Go think what we can do this. is to plan have... another class, um, you know, with the women, because we have over 150K women on our platform on Women of Ruby's um, Facebook page. So what we can do, you know, just by this conversation is to, you know, we have a series of, you know, courses coming on to so add this to it so you can come in and teach those women specifically. That way you can measure impact on that end of things. Because mm -hmm. if they join your class, there is no way I can measure impact to say, what did you learn? How did you make it? So when you have time, I know you are very busy. We can walk around that, you know, as long as you don't use shovel to bill us. <laughs> hey! My class is always low ticket. My class is 4,005. So okay. someone was like, Jennifer, the, the way you price your classes, and at the end of the day, anyway, that's by the way. So, so definitely, we'll, we'll, we'll do something we'll de we'll def do something with you um, this year by God's grace. And yeah, sure. And in case, I'm coming to your inbox, so me, I want to do no, what, what I call first. Yes. Because this year, this the target we have this year, we need to upgrade. <laughs> do you get We need to upgrade. So you, you have set your target, 1 million, 150. <laughs> I don't know. Let me say something in Igbo. Ego ke ejachuego. You use money to pursue money, but yeah. unfortunately, some of us you don't want to spend money, not knowing that you need. Sometimes you have to make this investment. Yes. So that your target. Yes. What are the things you need to do? You are a business person. How many times mm -hmm. have you paid an influencer to advertise your market? How mm. many times have you paid a Facebook ad? The, my mm. class is close to two thousand people mm -hmm. that have signed up for it. Mm -hmm. They didn't just come like that. Of mm -hmm. course, I, I was marketing it back to back. But mm -hmm. I was also paying other people to help me market it. So you spend money to make money. That big mm -hmm. target, I've told you to double your target. How can you make sure you hit it? Pay more, advertise your business. Advertise mm -hmm. your, I don't know, advertise yourself. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to say something. I got it. I talk too much. So it's okay. you know. What we can do, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, someone said they went on your page last week. And you know what she got was yeah unbelievable. Now that's what we're talking about. Exactly. Yes, this is the kind of feedback that I love. That she also went on your page and you saw all those information. So um, so what I'm gonna say, just to compliment what Jennifer said, is this, right? You can see Jennifer's energy. Listen, <laughs> this is going to be available on my YouTube channel at Esther for Go and watch it. This is not a show that you watch alone. I personally, yeah. I'm going to keep watching. It's an evergreen content, meaning if at any point I feel like I'm going off, right? It might not yeah. be where I am going out here in Canada. There is another, you know, video on my YouTube for the Canadian audience where I invited, um, you know, a financial instructor as well 
here in Canada who has done it and you know she's successful with you know all of these things that you mentioned so if you want that as well if you have if you are here in Canada that's for you however this is general because I also know that my audience got across so we have African Americans we have people who are from Nigeria and then Canada here so you can change your dollars into Naira you know invest into treasury bill just do that and say okay this extra money from this right so it's going to be available on YouTube and Jennifer mm -hmm. Myself and Jennifer, well, you're going to see us again this year. <laughs> yes, so. Meaning we're going to pick one person out of the people who joined today. I'm going to go through the list. And I'm going to check in to ask, did you use any of these tricks that Jennifer taught us? Which of these nuggets have you used in your business? And what is it looking like for you, right? So Jennifer, you know, one final word for a woman out there. Who after this show now would not take action? Just something to nudge that person into taking action. <laughs> How do I mean? Okay, maybe let me. I, I like talking from my experience a lot because mm -hmm. it's people relate better like that. Mm -hmm. Not long ago, mm -hmm. my salary was like 50,000. Mm -hmm. There is so much you can do with 50,000. But today, of course, we are still on the journey, but it is a whole lot more mm -hmm. what changed because i took action mm -hmm. that is it so you can if you like attend all the classes you like attend mm -hmm. all, if you don't take action nothing will happen i mm -hmm. have a oh i have said that i have a friend before you know it's now <laughs> we prolong the matter but mm -hmm. i'm encouraging you that you just have to take action if none of this thing tell your money where to go you are already mm -hmm. earning money now mm -hmm. always tell your money but telling your money where to go means that you are in control you know, mm -hmm. okay, this amount is going to save you. This amount is going mm -hmm. away. It, because if you don't do it that way, bills will direct it for you. That's mm -hmm. just the battle word for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Listen, um, you can join um Jennifer's class. It's starting in a week, like she said. And I'm also going to bring Jennifer for our Women and Women of Rubies because I'm selfish like that. <laughs> yes. So far, it's women and women and money. Yes. yes. Eh? We need to make me. So we are we are going to be partnering on a lot this year, I believe, by God's grace. Uh, money, I'm yeah. part of the Queen Tribe. Let me tell you guys. You see, I am one of just so you know that I'm one of those people. I will join something, and I'm. I be I be make I. So now with this session, now I am taking you know the nudge to move a step higher and say, let me do this. You know, be part of the tribe, do the needful. At least let us do it for this year, like you said. Even if it is 10 billion, I'm speaking that into existence. Because yes, people just, you can. People limit, limit themselves with money. I'm not humble with poverty. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not, not, no, 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 no. I'm not no, humble no, with no, poverty. No, no. I don't have a limited mindset when it comes to money. And I tell people, it starts with, you know, just to compliment and where I come from, maybe because of who I am. I'm very heavy on affirmation as well, right? So I tell people, beyond what I do properly in saving, there is also a part of me that believes that what you say to yourself does manifest. Your thought has power in controlling mm -hmm. every part of your life. So every, for the period in my life where I would be sad and think, oh, I am poor, oh, I don't have money, that became my reality. But the moment I started telling myself, I'm living in abundance, and abundance is not about the money you have. It's sometimes about the people. So when you are broken down, who is your support system? Who are you calling? Who is around you to lift you up, right? And now I have Jennifer now to do accountability partner, like Alpha. That regime money never reached me. <laughs> yeah. so thank you, everyone. Um, like I said, we're going to be back by God's grace sometime this year, maybe mid-year, for a quick check-in with Jennifer. And um, maybe we'll bring some of the people in your tribe to join and share their testimony. Because sometimes people love to hear and check in for women of rubies and jennifer we're going to be doing something with financial jennifer this year something definitely, free. definitely. Uh, it is not free. it is not free please this year stop looking for free 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 please. i'm on free mode no go and buy data you can't like listen you've got to go out of the comfort zone this year and do something sure. different for yourself right i blocked someone the other day i'm like you can't it's 2018, free mode, free mode. Officially, oh, oh, oh. anyway, Jennifer, thank you so much for your time. 
I appreciate it. Beyond that, thank you for your patience. I learned something yeah. from you today um, on the power of patience when you're intentional about something. Thank you for being intentional about the show today. And of yeah. course, please tell people how they can follow you aside from Instagram, where they can be follow you. Where can yeah, they um, so mostly I'm on Instagram and Facebook. Okay. Financial Jennifer on Instagram, Jennifer will be on Facebook. But I'm inviting you to come to the inner circle where you'll be seeing me your dreams pushing you to go and save your money. Join our community, it's free membership. But like mm -hmm. I told you, be ready to save every month. Thank mm -hmm. you so much, extra. I, I always get excited talking about money, knowing that at the end of the day, we are building which are wealthy and happier women. Yes. I'm so glad to do this tonight, and I'm looking forward and happy to coming back. And like I said, I'm coming to your DM because I need you to. That's you, you know the magic touch, like elevate things. Like I'm coming now. We'll talk about that one later. I'm, so I'm thank you, everyone. All right. Good All right. night from here. All Bye. Right.